And this is how we got or I got to tier 3 medium vehicle. Now first impression just a bigger vehicle with two machine guns into the bigger turret. Survivability 200 hit points, 48 millimeters in the front of the hill, 13 in the sides and 13 in the rear. But I must say the sight of the turret is a little bit sloped, so maybe no idea. Uh, the hill, I'm sorry, the hill is a little bit sloped and also it has some boxes and so on and so on. So maybe yeah, and I don't know if these pair track links are counted as armor. Also, turret armor, 50 in the front, logical. You must hold hold this gun here with something. 13 the sides and 13 the rear. 13, I'm sorry, in the rear. Again, the turret is sloped, so you will have some chances to bounce, but maybe lucky guess. If you fire here, you will damage something, I'm sure. In the front, in the sides, if you fire here between the track and the wheels, I'm sure you will penetrate down here you will penetrate in the back also you will penetrate and also with the tier 2 gun the automatic gun you can penetrate the commander's hatch and to in the upper structure beneath this hatch so yeah mobility stock t uh, stock tank mobility 142 horsepower engine uh, nearly 10 tons vehicle again 45 kilometers an hour in uh, forward direction and 18 in the backwards driver speed of the vehicle hold 33.87 which it isn't bad for tier 3 but it's not so good concealment I don't care I don't play like this View range, uh, let's just show you the concealment percent so you can know with what you are dealing but I think most of you will uh, well, go lightning fast through the, these tiers until tier 5 and you are not so interesting in, interested in this thing. Uh, view range. Was 65, so we'll, you will have 300 meters of view range, which is good. Signal, signal range. Uh, again, uh, to nearly, nearly 300 meters of single range for which, for tier three, it isn't bad at all. Okay, let's go to battle. Come on. 